Hello, hello, welcome back to the episode of Warframe. Like I said last episode, we are going to be uh, trying to do the, uh, the mastery rank test. And uh, also, as a quick note, by the way, the boy trailer got a alert mission added for him recently when he shows up. So you can actually just kind of go there instead of looking for the icon on the map. I, I don't know. Um... Personally, I prefer the icon on the map. It's a bit more, I don't know, interactive in my opinion compared to just having that drop down of things. Like, I, I get it. It's a great way to notify that, hey, he's here. Things are happening. Speaking of him. Tenno, Hi, Barrel. May I extend an invitation How you doing? To my latest collection of choice items from mm -hmm. the void is yep, now cool. available for cool, cool, cool. viewing. Uh, so, yeah, what he had this time around was Display Argyle Prisma Angstrom. Uh, the Katir Raza Cyandana, the Katir earpiece that I did not have. I had, I have everything else, as you can see. Uh, but yeah, I bought those four things. It took quite a while to actually get up the he amount of ducats for it. But, uh, I have one of everything here, which is cool. Uh, but yeah, this is pretty much what he has. And I, honestly, eh, there's nothing really here I would want to buy more of. Like, hell, I have seven copies of Astral Twilight. Uh, primarily because this mod actually drops off of enemies uh, quite commonly. Same with Vermilion Storm, though. I've actually recently sold them down back to one, so... Uh, I, I don't... I don't know why he's even carrying those two mods. Uh, Fang Fusilade and Temple Rail, I don't know. I, I think uh, Fang Fusilades might be the only one that I would actually want to try to buy to sell. Temple Royale, I think, only goes for like 40. Uh, other than that, the Prisma Angstrom, Prisma Veritux, and... Uh, I think that's it here, actually. Uh, I could try trading away for 40 to 60 plat uh, at the moment that I'm aware of. But I, I don't want to spend the time <laughs> to farm up more Ducats for it. So let's, uh, let's head on up to Seplan Samaras. Hello, Samaras and the Sanctuary. Alright, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. Three of the wishes were labeled. Uh, 21, 24 should be this one. Let's, uh, let's see if we can actually qualify for this one. Ah. <clears throat> uh, wait. No? Question mark? Wait, qualify. Okay. Uh, qualify for the Master Rank 24 test. You can only attempt this once per day. Are you ready to become Gold Dragon Rank? Hopefully. Uh, so yeah, we can actually see what the hell rewards are. Plus one minimum mod capacity? They actually indicate that now, huh? Interesting. I don't recall that ever being told to you about before, unless you were actually ranking up and be like, Oh hey, this number actually t coincides with my Mastery Rank. Uh, the Void Trace Storage increasing by 50. Yeah, it's been told. Uh, when that system came out. And, uh, Daily Standing Limit. Yeah, the... It's kind of a given if you pay attention to your limit. Uh, and the loadout slot is just kind of a common thing. Uh, but as far as I'm aware, this mission is operator only. Your fragile Tenno body is one of the most powerful forces in the known universe. Is it? Show me you know how to wield this force. Destroy the target without being destroyed yourself. Wow. Uh, uh. No. Okay, so going in biz gets him off. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Is this thing regenerating health? I see, uh, the energy bits give us... Actually restores our operator power. The, uh, energy orbs. So that's interesting. Okay. 
Uh, this mission's a little weird. Should be told. And why does it seem like it regenerates health? That ain't cool. We only get three attempts at this, huh? So, I mean, this is qualifying for it and not actually doing it at the moment. Why is it getting red? Oh, it's also getting smaller. Okay. Mission failed? What? Is there a time limit as well? Was there a time limit? Hmm. Okay, wait, why was that not qualifying? That was actually doing it, huh? That's... Stupid? First off, that, that is very stupid that the qualifying didn't work for that. Like, I did actually click qualifying, did I not? Is there a different button somewhere that I actually need to do? Is this it? 15. So it should be this one. Yeah, qualify. Is there a button somewhere? May also practice for this test by visiting Cephalon Samaras in the relay. In a relay. I did. I'm confused. Oh, qual- I'm an idiot. I misread. Practice. Practice would be uh, the, the term that I'm looking for, not qualify. Uh, but yeah, is there is there actually a time limit for this? I, I mean, uh, it's fine that I failed it. I, I'll at least know for uh, tomorrow on what the hell I need to be doing here. Ah, there is a there is a uh, time limit. Okay. Ah. Intriguing that there's a time limit. I had no idea. So we're given what, three minutes overall to do this? You know, I think now that I understand that there's a time limit. And what the hell is going on with this, and the fact that it reach, like, regenerates over time, I could probably do it. Yeah, I'm most confident I could probably do it now, now that I uh, know there's a time limit. And, uh, running around in a circle... Seems to work out quite well. Ah. Okay. So the megas only last for so long. It's helpful for me. There appears to be a range limit on my beam. I am not by any means used to. Oh. 
Got the target though. With uh, about 30 seconds left to spare, yeah, I can definitely do this. I can definitely do this. It's not that complicated. Uh, I I really should have paid attention though. What the hell I was thinking. Uh, and I never I realized now I kept saying qualify for that. So uh, oops, uh, my bad for being a complete idiot on that. Uh, y yeah, um, oops. <laughs> well, uh, the qualifying though, I mean, it, it, honestly, it didn't go too bad. Uh, I think we would have been able to get it had I noticed that there was a time limit with it. Uh, yeah, hi Darvel. Bye Darvel. Well, well, uh, we we have a couple melee ribbon mods though that we can actually try unlocking in the meantime until uh, I am able to do the test again. Uh, I, again, that was my bad. Uh, let's see, 34 enemies with finishers without getting uh, afflicted by a status chance. Uh, sure, let's do that one first. And I'm actually going to equip a different weapon for that one. Presumably the sheave. Actually, uh, you know what? Wait, we, we could. Together, now get out there and cut down the... Mm. And make the Lotus proud. Hmm. Yeah, if I get rid of this, it's going to lower my attack speed. The, the, see, the problem with that Sheev Ribbon is that the way I built that in the long run ended up being a bit of a problem. Uh, what do we what do we have for daggers? I, I know I have a ceramic dagger ribbon. Uh, what the hell did this do again? Oh, right. Like, everything damage and combo duration. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeesh. Okay. Uh, that one will be on then. Uh, oh, there wasn't anything else about this, right? Yeah, kill 34 enemies with feathers without getting afflicted by sash chance. That's fine. We can do that. Uh, solo, and we're actually going to do it in the in the void on Teshub, not uh, not Habit. Uh, the reason for that is because, well, we happen to be here last episode for the ribbon, so why why not? I guess. So, do not be afflicted by a status, and I have to kill them with the finisher. Which I don't think it would be too much of a problem. I suppose I could have... I could have used Enerose, actually. There, there is an augment for him that I could have uh, made viable. But I don't think I, I, I don't think it would, I don't think it would be a good idea overall, honestly. I don't think about it. Probably, probably wouldn't be. Also, goddamn, guys, stop, stop being alerted from like hundreds of miles away. It's like damn, uh, infested all over again. All right, barrels, blast proc. That was on me. Forgot about that. Also, why why are you guys still alerted? Yeah, why are you guys alerted? Stop being alerted. Hmm. Should we just abort? I think we abort. And do a different mission. Because I really don't know what was going on with those guys. Why they're all alerted. I have uh, hushed invisibility on, so my weapon shouldn't have been making sound. I get some of the exposure should have caused uh, uh, them being alerted. But not to the point that was going on. And uh, Mercury, you are Grenier, right? Uh, oh. Oh. Yeah. Uh, sure. We'll do this extermination alert. I don't know what it's for. And do it looks like. No one credits. But uh Grenier generally are better off at not being famously flirted, hopefully. There is a large platoon of Grenier Marines stationed here. Leave no one standing. Oh, that's a lot of guys standing all in the same direction. What's the less chance of a random barrel attack around here? Damn it. Uh, 
Let's see, seven seconds left. Double the door. Not gonna be able to get any more people killed. The thing about Dagger is how fast the execution animation is. It actually gets modified by attack speed. That's why that sheave ribbon is the way it is. Okay, we have 9 out of 34 enemies, huh? Ooh, I'm also gonna have to pay attention for arc traps. Just realized. Arc traps is uh, pretty much going to guarantee that number being reset. Odd me, which is not a good thing. I'm a grenade. Stop having the like weird occasional actual carrying for allies, but are you are you serious, Stalker? This is this is not the time. This is not the time for this, Stalker. Alrighty. <laughs> Damn it, Stalker. Really is not the time for this. Oh, there you are. Hello. Really not the time for this. At all. Wait. What? Are you having trouble to... Dispelling me there initially because you spawned in weirdly. Ow. Alright, that was a range fight. Probably not a good idea with Loki. Damn you and your vulnerability bullshit there. Well, I mean, the good news is uh, we, we're still able to do this river mob. In this mission. The good news is I had to deal with the perfect stalker. I'm doing only five damage. I really wish I could disarm you. I would disarm you would make this so much easier. God. Oh God. Orb. Orb of doom. <laughs> right away from the orb. What else did I get, by the way? Anything? Small impact. Disappointed. Ah, I can't believe we got interrupted by the stalker just for that. Will you people die now. God damn stalker. Foiling my plans. Oh, hey, diamond skin. That was actually a god. Uh, um, um. <laughs> Is there a good point for any of the uh, resistance mods? Is what I was going to say before. Getting confused by the floating butcher. I know there was when I was uh, early on in in the game when I was uh, doing Oregon derelict missions and fucking scorches and uh, witch jiggers were like the only things ever around, being able to destroy me through walls quite annoyingly. And I used flame resistance then, so uh, warm coat I think it's called. 
But other than that, I haven't really used it too much. Well, we're back up to 15 kills. I'm just gonna chill here for a moment, wait for my invis to be able to reset. Everybody to get slash procced right now. count. enough room in them to really move around effectively. Thirty-four. Thirty-one of thirty-four. Thirty-two of thirty-four. Just about there. I'd rather not take any slash procs. You can be dead, you can be dead, and you. Let's go. Oh, what the hell did you just show me? Damn it. Are you serious? Rock and roller. Alright, note to self. Kill rollers immediately in the future. Let's see, we have uh, 21 enemies left. Uh, there's gonna be a few more after that. We could probably still do this. This rubber mod should not be taking this long to actually complete. Really shouldn't. And this is good. This is not good. You guys still alerted? You are? Unfortunately. Though I suppose me bullet jumping right by you is probably not going to help that. Good, you're no longer alerted. And you are no longer alerted. They've uh, mostly stopped being alerted now. Good. Uh, I gotta wait for the uh, Invisigad. Oh, uh, I'm actually gonna come over here in the corner and activate Narmon. Just for those, uh, cheeky, cheeky crits. Like, if one wants to proc right now, that'd be great. Or, uh, not, like, right this second, but, uh, like, when my Imbus is about up, I can actually abuse it for a moment. God, you're blind. Yeah, 18 of 34. Oh, hey. Longer alerted down here. I'll take it.
Okay, neither they are they. Uh, we have how many out of uh, 30, 34? Twenty. The one. Two. I don't know if we're gonna have enough enemies. I'm starting to doubt has having enough enemies. Bit of distance. Maybe. Just maybe. Why did you turn around? I hate you for turning around. If we take our time, we should have enough people here do it. Not dealing with the rollers anymore. So I think this episode's probably been going on a bit long. I'd really like to finish this up. There's 32. Should probably get one last wave of enemies in this... Yep. Okay. Cool. Oh, we actually have a bit of time left. Okay, we got the 34. We can get that out of here. It is just across the way. Thank God. <laughs> if that number reset again, I, I would have been very, very sad. Apparently we put, never put a lens on the ceramic dagger. Interesting. Might have to do that, though. You know, I, the only reason I really chose the ceramic dagger is because uh, the sheave is mostly my main dagger weapon. Oh, the, God damn it. Again with the other daggers? Wait. Was it the other daggers or the other swords? Oh, it was the Ether Reaper. And the dual okay, it was the dual Ether and the Ether Reaper they got. Never mind. I understand if you have to sell mods. Maybe Ordis will need a similar fate someday. Alright, um Yeah, I think that I'll have to do me for now. So, uh bit of a failure on my part on reading properly on the mastery rank testing for practice. Not qualifying? I don't know what made me think qualify was practice. I really don't. Actually, wait. Wait. I know what made me think of that. Uh, qualifying and racing. For, like, qualifying for your position. Like, there, there, there's a uh, test lap, if you will. Uh, for, like, fastest time and blah, blah, blah. Stuff like that kind of thing. Uh, at least in video games. I don't know if it's real life. I'm not a race car fan. Uh... I, I, I guess that intermixed with the word qualify as in it being a practice run rather than the word practice which I completely ignored trying to read at all I, it, it's like I've never played this game before I don't know uh, oh uh, this melee ribbon mod's gonna be freaking annoying uh, but yeah that'll have, that'll have to do me for now next episode we'll take on that other ribbon mod and uh, let me actually put the ceramic one back on uh, but yeah until then I hope you guys have enjoyed until next time as always take it easy hmm? oh or just right have fun with that words <laughs>